Yo, Kazakh Konnichiwa, and welcome everyone back to the Swift DT channel. I'm John once again today with Nao, and today, that's right, we're gonna be checking out some Ayaka. Mm -hmm. I have seen her in Moichiro, and I actually know one of her songs yeah. way back when I was a little baby kid. I wasn't a baby, but I was a teenager. <laughs> I was playing Final Fantasy Crisis Core, yeah. and her song was at oh, the end of it. Right. The song Why? In the game. In the game. Oh, Man. I if anyone grew up seeing that scene, mm. oh, it brings tears to my eyes every single time. It but that makes was, you cry. <laughs> it, it makes me feel emotional, yeah. But like, you know, it's one of those... I didn't even know that it was Ayaka. Mm. I didn't what, know. Was it English song or a Japanese song? Do you remember? That was Japanese. Oh, okay. It was, a, it was definitely Japanese. Mm. It just had some English lyrics in there. Oh, okay. But that song, man, super, super emotional. In Mo Ichido, she did, did an amazing job with yes. her, like, she has a very her dynamic voice. voice. Yeah. It's very unique. It's, mm. almost, it's like in the mid between being low range and high range. Yes. Like, she true. can just, she can go super low mm. or super high, sort of yes. thing. Yeah. Without trying, mm. as per se. Yes. But yeah, I'm super excited to check out Ayaka. I wanted to see some more. Nile's been nagging me to see some more ever since we did Mo Ichido mm -hmm. because she grew up with Ayaka, listening yes. to some Ayaka She's songs. She's actually my generation. Right. I, yeah. Yeah, so for me, I have no idea. So I'm looking forward to this one. Today we're going to be reacting to Mikazuki, mm -hmm. the Crescent Moon, I believe. Yes. Crescent Moon. Yep. Yeah. So I'm excited to go into it. But do you know what comes first? Intro time! time. Okay, so Ayaka Mikazuki, let's jump straight into this one and let's get it. え、この曲を弾き語りするのはものすごく久しぶりなので緊張するんですが、え、ちょっと苦痛の意で本気でちょっと歌いたいなと思います。<笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑> That is so beautiful. Oh. 
これやんありがとうございましたあやかさんありがとうございました素晴らしいですね<笑> that, that was so good that was so so good wow So, It's weird. I already knew that this song, but like、uh, I still feel like, oh. I was gonna say, did you, did you know this song? You know? Yeah, I knew that. Because, like, knew that. when you see that you grew up with、uh, Ayaka, I was like, does that mean that you know this song, maybe? Who knows? No, the, like, I think like a live version is like、uh, much different, more like、uh, emotional. Right, right. Do you know what, I, no. what was going through my mind when I was watching this? I was thinking, this song.、Mm. The song would pair so well, like really well, with wherever you are.、Oh. <laughs> the only reason why I'm saying that, right, is wherever you are, it's kind of like, you know, wherever you are always make you smile.、Yes. But this one is more like them missing someone that is far away,、mm. right? So it's, it's, like it's, a, it's, it feels like a guy in a girl's point yes, of view. Yes, boy side and girl <laughs> yeah, side. That's what it seems like to me. I don't know. I don't know. That's just, for me, I feel like they'll pair really well together. And they both had that slow piano sound to、yes. it, you know. I didn't know that Ayaka could play the piano as well.、Mm, very, he's really very, good at playing、nice. the piano. Yeah. I loved the chorus in this one, you know, how I was going into the.、Yeah. But then the No More Cry part、mm. was like full, like, whisper. Yes. It was like in the falsetto whisper. It's still beautiful. It's, you know,、yeah. It sounds so beautiful, amazing. And saying no more cry as well. So, you know, it has that emotion to it、mm. with like the glitter and stuff falling、yes. down behind her.、Mm. Absolutely amazing. I did, I love that、um, little melody part. Was... So, you know, there's so many ways to sing, like,、uh, the sometimes really powerful.、Mm. So, like,、uh, yeah. This. For me, so I saw the beginning, it said 2006, right?、Mm. I feel like this could be one of those like timeless sounding songs.、Mm. What I'm meaning by this is you could have released this song in the 70s, 80s, 90s, 2000s,、yes. late 2000s,、mm-hmm. whenever, and it would still fit in with the generation.、Yes. That's what I, I feel like personally. Because,、mm-hmm. you know, you could, you could compare this to, like, say, maybe like old diva ish sounding people、yes. and like with their super emotional songs、yes. as well yeah and then all of those songs are timeless i feel like this fits in right with all of them as well、mm, yeah so it's yeah. just one of those it's really really nice really really beautiful i did not expect this、yes. i did know that ayaka has a beautiful voice anyway、mm. because of of the song why yeah but i didn't know this song and i didn't know the like how much raw Feelings that it like、yes. pours out to you while you're listening to it. That reminds me that like、uh, I have an experience, and then like when I got a job,、right. I moved to the Tokyo from Osaka,、right. and then I had a boyfriend at、right. that time, and then in a on a blue train, every time I listen to this song, when, <laughs> when I needed to back to the Tokyo from Osaka,、right. and then like uh, but like uh. Even though I was listening to this song, like,、uh, I. Were, were you like, um. Were you like a. Like an adult or like a teenager? Adult. Okay.、Yeah. I, was, I was gonna say, Even like. Even an adult, <laughs> like, I was. But, like, uh. You know, she said, like, a、uh, no more cry, but I was crying a、But、lot. Is... And then one more thing the difference is, like,、uh, he didn't say he loved me. <laughs>、uh, do, you know, do you know what, uh. What this. Kind of like in my brain,、mm. I thought maybe you were like in school or something. No. And it was like a school crush. Do you know who I feel like would get really impacted with this song? Nosy Bro. Nosy Bro listening to this song, people are like, Ah,、oh, yeah, I can imagine. <laughs> you know, you can picture the, the tears coming with him saying, Was, you know. Yeah. Yeah. But I think like he's calling already. No, who knows? <laughs> yeah. Who knows? I'll send this to him after. I feel like that'd be pretty funny. Yeah. But thank you so, so、thank、much for this song. Okay, so that was our reaction to Mikazuki from Ayaka today. If you guys enjoyed that, hit that thumbs up button, subscribe down below. Don't forget to hit the bell button for more videos every single day. And the keyword for today, we're gonna have it as missing you. Because when you're far away from someone, you generally miss them. So you just say, hey, I'm missing you. Yeah. Yeah, so we're gonna put that down below. And this song here is super emotional, very beautiful. The melody, very, very beautiful. You know, I, once again, I did not expect that Ayaka would be playing the piano at the same time as well.、Mm. She has a, such a good range. It is really dynamic and you、yes. can really feel the emotion coming from it.、Mm-hmm. So it's one of those I really, really appreciate it. I'm glad 
now actually mm -hmm. because you know i didn't know at the beginning that she did do final fantasies oh, yeah. why mm -hmm. until after i did moichiro yes then and some, then, like, somehow uh, just skipped my mind yeah yeah oh wait i know this voice <laughs> exactly so Same i've experienced voice. it i've got a little taste of experience mm -hmm. And I just thank you so, so much for this. So we're going to be thank definitely you. checking out some Waiyaka mm -hmm. in the future. Definitely, yeah. Absolutely. So stay tuned for all of those. And after all of that, mm -hmm. I'll see all of you guys tomorrow. Bye.